Hello everyone, welcome back again to OnHow channel. My name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment. If you are wondering again, why is that? Because simply, I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to add the hover effect on navigation menu for your Shopify store. And I mean on the header navigation menu, obviously. So if you have a navigation menu on your header, uh, the customer doesn't have to click actually to show him the menus and sub menus. He just have to hover with the mouse over the menu and it will show him the menu that he's interested in. And just to make it more clearly, let me show you how it works. By the way, this is the Shopify store that I do all the tutorials on. And all the things you see here are based on tutorials, including the video banner right here, as you can see. I did show that how to add them without any apps or anything like that. And it works for every team, as well as the header, transparent header right here. As you can see, the video is actually playing underneath the header and the header is completely transparent. And the transparent header as well, I did show how to make them without any apps or anything like that and it works for every team as I said and a lot of teams this is just two that I showed you right now which is the things that are from like me if I scroll down a little bit there is a lot of things that no one will show you on YouTube including the like this adding the gradient color like this to a, a only a section not the whole Shopify store only a section as well as the background picture for only a section again as you can see so all the things on the Shopify store I did show them based on tutorials and what I'm going to show you in this video is, for example, you see categories in here and there is a menu in here. As you can see, I'm hovering with the mouse over it, but it does not show me the categories. In order to show me the categories, I need to actually click on it. Then it will show me the category. Well, how can I enable the hover effect so the customer doesn't have actually to click on it? He can just, uh, from, uh, just hover with the mouse over it like this and it will show me the header just like I click it on it right now so I will show you how to add that and again it works for every team I did test it on three teams actually because I didn't have time I'm working a lot of stuff I have SAO blogs I have two Shopify stores and I do uh, this YouTube channel for a side thing and I do like making videos that's why I'm doing this I did test them as I said in three teams the refresh team and sense team as well as down team which is the one I'm using right now and demonstration I'm going to use down team but as I said I test them on every team and without any more talking let's just get to it and show you how to add the hover effect to the navigation menu on your header for your Shopify store but before we start please if this video helped you out help me out pressing that like button I would really appreciate it it's completely free and it will motivate you to make more videos for you guys and especially things I requested by subscribers because I do make a lot of videos are requested by subscribers so if you have any video requests just drop me a comment i will be happy to make a video for you but for now let's just get to it and show you how to add the hover effect to the navigation menu for your shopify header and the first thing we're going to do is obviously access the shopify dashboard right then the next thing you're going to do is click on online store from here as you can see simply click on it then click on the three dots right here on the left of customize button then click on edit code right here and as always I do mention the steps like click here click there for people are not familiar with Shopify then it will show you the code editor on your Shopify team the next thing you're going to do is we need to find a specific section and I mean file sorry a specific uh, liquid file and liquid is basically a language programming language based on Ruby Rails and that's what Shopify uses in order to make scripts and so on. So we need to find, and no worries, we're not gonna edit any code or uh, write a new code or something like that. I will provide you with the full code and really short code that will do the trick. And as I said, you just have to copy it and paste it. Then I will give you my support as well. As I said, I'm working for you. If you have any issues with this, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. As I said, the next thing we're going to do is find a section. And that section called header.liquid. So instead of checking out the folders in here to find it, you can simply use the search bar right here. You can see at the top of the page, simply click on the search bar and type in header and you will see the header.liquid right here, the first one as you can see. So simply click on it and it will show you all the code for it, just like you see right now. So in here, we need to access a specific section and this is really important. If you did pass the code in an other section other than the section I will show you right now or the line in the code that I will show you right now, it will not work properly. So make sure you follow the steps correctly. So the next thing we're going to do is find forward slash header. You can use uh, control F if you are Windows or control uh, command sorry f if you are on on mac then it will show you this prompt and you can search for uh, forward slash header and it will highlight it on the code for you 
Uh, in my case, it does show, it doesn't exist, I'm not sure why. So here is a font that, as you can see, forward slash header. In my case, I'm not sure what the problem here is. Uh, Google Chrome keeps bugging on me. Anyway, just search for the line uh, five, 515, just like you see 515. Or use the trick I did show you, which is command F and search for forward slash header, just like you see right now. Then after you find forward slash header, we need to pass a specific code I will provide to you below forward slash header and this is important as well make sure you do paste it below not above below which is in my case uh, forward slash header it's in, in line 513 then i'm going to paste it in 515 which is below forward slash header as i said so obviously the next thing you're going to do is scroll down the description box and you will see a link name it as code then simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a very short code as you can see it's 16 lines to be exact and this code will do the magic yes so simply and as i said again it works for every team i did test it on refresh team and the sense team and now i'm using in demonstration which is down team so let's just copy the code in here then right click and copy it then we will get back to the code editor right here and we're going to paste it as i said below forward slash header which is a line 515 in my case in your case i'm not sure what should be and i think it's the same as the refresh team i don't remember anyway you get the idea right and as i said if you have any issues and you can couldn't find it simply drop me a comment below i will be happy to help you out and i do reply to each comment yes so uh, simply i'm going to click here then i'm going to paste it in the line 515 which is below forward slash header so i'm going to paste it in here then i'm going to save the changes and after the changes will save it i'm going to get back to the shopify store and i'm going to reload the page then it should be working so let's just reload the page now and here we go so right now you see the mouse in here so if i did hover over the category in here it should show me the category without having to click on it so let's just do that here we go as you can see i can just hover over it it will show me the category i don't have to click for it even it will show you the subcategory without having to click on it you see the subcategory i don't have to click on it i can just hover and it will show me the subcategories without having to click on it and the same as the category as well and this will work for every header and every uh, navigation in my case the only navigation i have a uh, sub menu for it which is the category that's why the only thing i have to test it right now and again this works for every team as i said and just like i said in the beginning of the video i'm working for you but for now that's how you add the hover effect on the header navigation menu for your shopify store and as i said if you have any questions any video requests make sure to drop me a comment below or check out my instagram right here below me i don't reply to each comment if you are wondering again why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one